and welcome to a new video. Today I'm in the province of Asti and I'm about 15-20 minutes from the city of Asti this way and Torino is about 30 minutes this way. And I'm in a beautiful little historic town. More about that later. What I'm here to show you is this wonderful private home and bed and breakfast. It is just gorgeous and fully restored and is a turnkey property. Now the property is divided up into four parts. We've got the private area, which is a three bedroom, three bathroom uh, living space. We've got three bed and breakfast rooms with a breakfast uh, dining room. And then we have three apartments. So there's huge possibilities. It's a really great business. And like I say, it's a beautiful property. So what we're going to do first is take the helicopter. I'll show you from above so we can understand which those apartments are. And then I'm going to give you a personal tour of the property so you can really understand its layout and appreciate what a wonderful property is being offered here. You're going to really like this one. Stay right to the end and I'll tell you all about the history of the town and also how much you can get this property for. So this first area is the private area and this has three bedrooms and three bathrooms. The second part of the building is the three bed and breakfast apartments and a breakfast room and sleeping up to six people. The third part is three apartments with three bathrooms. The first one can sleep six people and the other two can sleep four people each. Now this part, we'll call it number four, is a workshop, a, a tool shed, but it can be made into a one bedroom apartment. And beyond this, through this beautiful historic gate, we come into this wonderfully manicured garden. And then of course we have the swimming pool. So let's relax in the courtyard for a moment and I'll tell you a little bit about the history of the house. Now the current owners, they bought it in 2004 and they fully restored it by 2008. And the swimming pool was added in 2019. Now, as already mentioned, it's located in a beautiful, historic, peaceful town. And it's part of the province of Asti. And it's been that way since the 12th century. Then in 1577, Emanuele Filiberto, the Duke of Savoy, he bought this town and three others for 70,000 pieces of gold. It has a beautiful castle. The castle is now privately owned and it just really is a beautiful and wonderful place. Perfectly located because you've got everything on your doorstep here. Asti, Alba, the Barolo area. Turin is really easy here as well, so it's a great location, great place for tourists to come and stay and a great place to live. I in fact live just 20 minutes south of here and I can say it's a really great place to be. So that's the history of the place. What we need to do now is to do a tour. So I'm going to give you a, a live tour. I'll walk around with the camera so you can see all the aspects of this wonderful property. So let's do it. So what we're going to do first is look at the bed and breakfast rooms. Now here's the main entrance, but let's go into the bed and breakfast section. So here on the left, we have the first bedroom, bed and breakfast room. And uh, it's a basic room, but it has everything anybody would need if they're staying here and a bathroom with toilet, hand mason, and a shower. And then if we go out into, we come onto this wonderful terrace, what a beautiful place to sit. With a view over the pool and the countryside. Imagine your guests sitting here with a glass of wine, a pair of TV, enjoying this wonderful place. Now, if we continue up the stairs, and here we have the second bed and breakfast room. Again, very simply decorated, but, but beautiful. See the wood paneled ceilings, the beams, 
And uh, again, the beautiful view. Maybe the TV needs updating, but apart from that, you're fine. And then we have the bathroom, which again, shower, toilet, hand basin, all in very nice condition. Then we continue up the stairs again. And we come to our third bed and breakfast room. This is very red. A little bit bigger than the other room. But you can see again, nicely decorated ready for business immediately, big double bed, and the same bathroom as the, the one below with a shower, a toilet, and a hand basin. Now what we're going to do is just go down you may notice as we walked up, there's the breakfast room. And here we go, a place for your guests to be served their breakfast. And this connects onto the kitchen in the private part of the house, which I'll show you in a moment. There we go, a nice space for your guests to enjoy their coffee and croissant in the morning with a view over the courtyard. So that's the bed and breakfast area. Three rooms, three bathrooms, sleeps up to six people. And get in touch with me for details about how much these rent for. So, bed and breakfast, now the main entrance. So we're going to walk through here, this beautiful entrance. It's really quite fantastic. And you can see it's all done in red brick, all the classic old red brick and the uh, wood beam ceilings. And it brings us into this beautiful courtyard. Take a look at this. And this is completely private. There are no other buildings overlooking it apart from the church bell tower. But it's really quite fantastic. And done with real taste, you can see there's a, a plastered building in the middle there. These are the apartments. And we've got this seating area. And this is a tool shed. I'll show you this in a moment, but this actually can be converted into a one bedroom apartment if you wanted to expand the business. This wonderful seating area. Imagine yourself sitting here on a cool summer evening, autumn, enjoying this serenity that this place offers. This directly in front of us is the private area, manicured lawns, just really beautiful. So from here, our little seating area, let's take a look at the apartments. And we have the three apartments in front of us here. Let's take the one to the right. We can see straight away there's a kitchen, all in very nice order. As I've said, it's a turnkey property, ready for guests immediately. A nice relaxing area and dining space. It's 
big windows and they are tinted so not too much bright sunlight and again the wooden ceilings beams beautifully done now we can go upstairs to the sleeping area the bedroom and bathroom I can tell you it's very hot today so here we go here's the the night space bathroom in front of us there there's a desk for those that have to work when they go on vacation and a big double bed and this beautiful view onto the courtyard and as I say it's completely private there's nobody else overlooking no other windows from any other houses it's all very nice let me just make an adjustment to my camera there so we can see that a bit better there we go how's that It's a beautiful courtyard, very private. And a bathroom with shower. So let's go from apartment number one into apartment number two. And I'll just hop over this wall here. And then, and we have apartment number two. Again, nice layout, its own kitchen. So people can stay here for one, two weeks, however long they want. You know, I even get clients these days asking me for two months that they want to stay. So you've got the potential to do all these kind of things because people can live here for a good amount of time. And this has these beautiful ceilings. Let me uh, just go up to here and you can see these beautiful brick vaulted ceilings with wooden beams. You know, a lot of people when they restore, they replace these with steel beams, which is, uh, which is nice, but never as nice as these, putting back the old beams. I can tell you this is very expensive to do. And then we can go upstairs to the nighttime space. We got a bedroom, very nice. Beautiful and cool in here as well on a hot day like today. You can see this one also has uh, a washing machine, a super small washing machine. So for people that stay in a long time, can even do their own laundry. And it has a bathroom with shower, toilet and and basin all in excellent condition nicely tiled and super clean So let's go and look at apartment number three. So this doorway here. So here we go, and we have two sofa beds here. So there's ample space for six people in this apartment. And as we come around, you'll see that there's also a kitchen. So the guests can be fully independent and stay for a long time. Microwave oven fridge and again this has these beautiful ceilings they're really quite special now we can go upstairs to the nighttime area and there we go we come into this low bed big double bed 
and a beautiful room. This really is quite fantastic with this big, big old barn door. These beautiful ceilings. I don't think your guests would be disappointed if they stayed here. And the same again, a bathroom with washing machine, toilet, bidet, and shower. So now we go into the private area of the house. And here we enter this uh, beautiful, beautiful living space. Uh, you saw probably to the right, there's a stairway to the bedrooms, but this gorgeous living room, fireplace, huge TV. <laughs> and again, the wood panels and wood beam ceilings. And here is, uh, at the moment there's a bed here, but this is usually a um, living space as well, a, a part of the, the living room. But uh, a table and chairs could be put here. You can see there's the aircon unit, but at the moment it's uh, being used as a bedroom. And there's a glance of what we just came. And just over here, uh, is the laundry. There's, there's also a, a, a toilet in there as well, a toilet and a hand basin, and the washing machine and dryer, etc. But you can see it's a beautiful room. And then we go up these little stairs here, and we enter the kitchen. And again, a very nice space, beautifully done. If you're a keen chef, you've got everything you need here. see it's a beautiful kitchen nice and cool here as well it's very warm today it's in the 30s but here very cool and you've got a beautiful view onto the garden there let me just adjust my camera so you can see okay now we're going to head upstairs to the bedrooms there's a little gate here, that's for the dogs. Now you might remember this door when we were in the bed and breakfast dining space and that's this door here. So there's a connection to the living space here should you need it. And here again, it's a beautiful living space. Here's the first bathroom, done in fantastic colors. Hand basin, shower, bath, toilet and bidet. Nice and vibrant with a fantastic view. And remember there's privacy glass there, so no problem. And we come along the hallway and into the first bedroom. And again, a beautiful space. Wood floors, fitted cabinets. Of course, all these things will stay. Then we come along the hallway and we find our third bedroom. Just used as a storeroom at the moment, but of course it can be used as a bedroom. More like a walk-in closet at the moment. And then we come to the master bedroom. We come up these stairs. You might remember these stairs in the kitchen. You can see the underneath of them in the kitchen. 
and we, we have the master bedroom. It's a beautiful space. It's kind of open plan feel, walk-in closet there, storage space above as well. So it's well thought out. And you have the master bathroom with shower, nice big hand basin, toilet and bidet. And like I keep saying, everything is in super condition. It's all just done so nicely. A real turnkey property. And that's it of the private area. We've got the cellar below, so we'll take a look there. Let's go back down the stairs. Okay, so now we're going into what's called in Italian the cantina, or the cellar. And I can tell you it's like natural air conditioning here. It's about 30 degrees centigrade outside. Very warm, but here is just beautiful and you can see it's a lovely space. This will make a perfect dining room or if you're doing weddings, it's a nice place as well if it rains. At the moment, it's not really used for anything, just sometimes the guests use it if quite a few people are renting friends together and they want a party space together. It's a lovely room. No signs of moisture or damp. And then through here, you have a bathroom. Just a WC and a hand basin. This really could be made into something fantastic, putting a big dining table there, some nice artwork on the walls, and you've got yourself a lovely, lovely living space. Really beautiful. So what do you think? It's a beautiful property, isn't it? And the owners are selling for a genuine reason. Get in touch and I'll explain that. We have all the details, the plans, and also the finances as well. Uh, this property can generate 200,000 euros a year, and there's a potential for expansion. Run properly, run it well. You've got a great life here and a great business. Now, as you probably know, there are bed and breakfasts for sale. They come up for sale now and again. Sometimes at best they're mediocre. This one is a turnkey property. It's been restored to perfection. It really is beautiful. So I think it's something really special and it's going to sell very, very quickly. So move fast on this one. Now, I told you at the beginning I was going to tell you how much this is. So thank you if you've got this far. The asking price is 975,000 euros. Let me say that again, because you probably don't believe it. 975,000 euros, so just under a million euros gets you this place. We can get all the figures for you about what it's going to cost to buy, the agent's commission, the, the taxes, etc. We can have all that for you, and we'll be very happy to help you and assist you in buying this property if that's what you want to do. So thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate all the subscribers I've got. I'm trying to do more video. I want to do just video and, and your support is, is so helpful. So keep subscribing. If you haven't subscribed already, just click those buttons and I'll be very, very happy to uh, hear your comments as well. If you've got any suggestions about what you'd like to hear, I'd be very happy to hear from you. You can put a comment below or you can go to my website and send me an email through that, whatever you want to do. So thank you again. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. I can promise you the next property is quite fantastic. It's going to be quite a, a special property. It's, it's historic. It had a famous owner and it's just beautiful. So look out for that one. Thanks again for watching. See you soon. You can probably hear, all you can hear is the crickets and the trees and the birds. It's and the lawnmower and the airplane. <laughs> you can hear the trees, yeah.